Say man, hey man. It's your boy Dwight on Hollywood back with another NBA 2K24 next gen build video. But before I get into the build, I need you guys to let me know in the comments what is your favorite social media platform. What is your favorite social media platform? Okay, so with this build, we have the two way mid range threat. You can create this build at different heights, totally up to you, um, but we will give this build some balance, a little post scoring. We got some mid-range shooting, three-point shooting. Um, you can get your own shot, and you can play some defense. So make sure you guys watch the video to the end so I can show you this masterpiece. Choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. But before going to the you already know what time it is. If you don't know, now you know. It's like button time, and I need you guys to go down and hit the like button. Get this video to 100 likes, and if you haven't already, hit the link in the description to follow me on Twitch, and hit the link in the description to join the Discord. We are almost at 100 followers over there, so I would appreciate you guys go ahead and hit that link for me. So with this build, we're going to the shooting guard position, 6'9 for the height, 188 on the weight, 7'5 wingspan. Let's get into it. So we're going to start with the finishing, right? So with the finishing on this build, I wanted to give you a little bit of everything, okay? So we can't take the driving dunk too high because it would change the name of the build. So we're going to take the driving dunk to an 80. We're going to get the layup to an 80 so we can get fearless finish on silver. Slithery on silver, that's pretty good. Um, we're going to do a 75 on the standard dunk instead of a 73 like I normally do. Okay, and we're going to do a 75 on the post control. And the 75 on the standard dunk is for, um, I think you get Giannis dunk package, I want to say, with the 75. But um, that's why we did it. So, looking pretty balanced on the finishing, if you ask me, man. Um, like I said, a little bit of everything. Okay, um, it may not look like much to you guys that want to specialize in something, and you know you might probably thinking like, oh, that's that you, you do it's too low. Like, no, it's not too low. Like, you can get good dunk packages with the 80. You can get good layup animation with the 80 layup. You can get uh, standard dunk animation with the 75. Um, you can get post post moves like you got drop step on silver and you got post spin on silver. So you're also going to get uh, post fade feet um, I think on gold or Hall of Fame. We'll see it here in a second. But we're going to take the strength up, of course. And we're going to get that vertical up a little bit. We can't get contact done, but we're good with that. Okay, so this is what we have for the finishing. And I think it's pretty good in my opinion. But let's go ahead and get it to the green beam. Make your guru screen badger. Starting with the mid-range shot. So the mid-range shot and the post control kind of go together. Okay, so if you want to do just regular post move, that's fine. But if you want to get in the post and do post fade, we have an 86 mid-range shot on this build. So there you go, man. We do we get gold post fade. If you know, I thought it was Hall of Fame. But we do get gold. Okay, because I tried to take the post control up to an 85, but they changed the build name, and I didn't want that build name, so that's why we took it back down to a 75. So with the 86 on the mid-range shot, you do get open looks um, on goal. You get mid magician on goal. You also get catch and shoot on goal, which is really good and guard up. I don't see people talking about that badge, but uh, I'm pretty sure it probably does activate. You know what I'm saying? But, um, you know, you got a lot of good badges on this build. Now with the three-point shot, we took that up to a 77. Um, you actually can go to a 76 for real, for real, because you don't get anything extra at 77, um, but an extra tick on your three-point shot. So some people want that extra tick, so that's why I did it. And, um, you know, you get, like I said, 76 or 77, right? So with the um, three-point shot, we only get silver badges for that. Um, Space Creators on silver, um, Green Machine on silver, Corner Specialist, Claymore is on silver, Dead Eye, uh, Blinders is also on silver. So... I still think that's pretty good, man. You will be able to make a lot of shots. And when you go to create the jump shot, you will be creating the jump shot with the 86 three point. I mean, with the 86 mid range shot instead of the 77 three point shot. So that's a great thing. You know, you want to have options when you're creating the jump shot. You know, it's easy to go in the jump shot creator and create a jump shot with a high three point shot. But it's hard to go in there with just a, like a, okay, let's take this down. Like, what if you just had a 77? That would be super hard. To create a jump shot so i understand why everybody is going with the mid-range and then with the mid-range you can get better badges as you can see if we go straight 77 right uh we got a lot of bronze badges but if, once we take it to an 86 you see a lot of badges turn gold and a lot of badges turn silver so i understand but you know you have to understand too that i just can't create builds with mid-range shot every time you know what i'm saying like i have to create different builds and build names and things of that nature so um, I hope you guys understand that. But let's go ahead and get into the sauce. But before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody need mama can see this video. And I need everybody mama to see the video. So do that for your boy, boy. Now, and I was just going back and forth with this, man. Like, 
do I want higher passing or not? But I just ended up taking it to a 70. Some people may complain about that. Some people may be okay with it. But that's just the business I'm in. You feel what I'm saying? So if you want higher passing, go ahead and take it up. That's up to you. Uh, we do an 80 on the lay. I mean, on the uh, ball handle, which is pretty good. And we do a 75 on the speed with ball. So you will be able to get your own shot with this build, and we're gonna come down to take the speed up. See, this is the only thing I really don't like about 69 is that you can't get silver speed boost, or you can't get silver blow by. Um, you know, you can't get gold anchor breaker and things like that. So you know, that's the only drawback for me. You know, because I have two 69s and I have two six foot eight bills. You feel what I'm saying? So I know, well, I got three six foot eight bills, okay? I got um, a center that's six eight, I forgot about that. But like I said, man, it, it's some, some, some good and some bad with six nine, there's some good and some bad with six eight. Just like every height, you know, you got the good things, you got the bad things. So, you know, it just depends on what you want and how you play and who you play with that will determine the height you need to go with because you can't even get where's the bass okay we go to defense okay you can't even get 94 feet on 6.9 you know it's some some things like that you know what i'm saying like you can't get the steel super super high you know that's just a few things that you have to deal with when you go 6.9 but overall 6.9 is a really really good height don't sleep on it okay so with the playmaking on this build you see what we got um silver silver triple strike silver hyperdrive and we got a couple more civil, civil badges for this build. Now, let's get into the defense. So, with the defense, I wanted to make sure that we got the two-way name. So, in order to get the two-way name, we had to take the um, perimeter defense to an 87. Some builds is an 88, some is an 87. And with this one, it's an 87. So, that's what we went with. Like I said, we can't get 94 feet on this build uh, because you have to be 6'8". But we do have some um, good silver badges on this build. Anchor braces, clamps, fast feet, pick dodge, and things like that. For the steel, we're going to do an 85 on the steel so we can get silver gloves, silver intercept, and silver right stick gripper. And as you can see, the interior defense did go up on its own, as you can see. And we do get anchored with that because we have some shot blocking on the build. We have a 79 on the shot blocking, which will give us a uh, chase down artist on silver, pogo on bronze, and anchor on bronze, which is pretty good in my opinion. Now, we don't add any rebound. You can add some if you want to. That's totally up to you. Um, we have an 80 on the speed. You can get it to an 81, but I don't see no huge difference from 80 to 81. Uh, 73 acceleration, uh, 74 strength, 74 vert. That's all you need to get chase down artists on silver, and the rest is on stamina. Now, let's get into these shades up. Are you ready? Because guess what? I do not clickbait. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now, we do have shades of Eddie Jones. We got Mikael Bridges. We got Clay Thompson. They name pop up all the time. And we have the two-way mid-range threat. That's the bill. And don't forget to let me know in the comments what is your favorite social media uh, site. I think I, I think that when I said favorite social media platform. Platform, whatever. Uh, let me know that in the comments. No matter here. Charge!